guys, this is going to be a two video or a two part lesson on resolving mistakes. How to resolve mistakes that you make in front of people when you're nervous or if you're playing in front of a large group of people or if you're tired or whatever the case may be. How do you incorporate a practice that you can do on your own that will prevent you from making horrible mistakes in front of people or at least uh, kind of save you when you're when you're in those difficult positions um, and I know how to do that a buddy of mine played a show last night and he was fixated on all the mistakes that he made um, and I basically explained to him that there's ways around that and that's what I want to show you so what you need to do is establish a structure that you practice under and then identify the structure once you do that you will be able to um, correct your mistakes as you're playing, even if you're extremely nervous or, you know, whatever the case may be, uh, you forget what you're playing. Uh, it's establishing a core, like a fundamental core that you can, that can kind of kick in. It's almost like autopilot. Um, and there's a ton of ways to do that. We're going to focus on two structures in this lesson. We're going to focus on the major scale structure and the pentatonic minor scale, which is Pretty common in bluegrass. So first you start with the key of G and just your major scale. you can play that fluidly um, try to pick up the pace a little bit and then the next very important step is to identify your intervals what does that mean intervals just mean space uh, and you can identify the space between the notes with just numbers very simple. Just count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, one. One more time. One, two, three, 